Hey, hello everybody, and how's all my friends out there doing today? It's Thursday, 1.20 p.m., and I just uh, stopped to get some gas, and on the way back, uh, see the mountain is out, so I thought I would give everybody uh, a view of the mountain. So that's Denali right there. And uh, let's see. Uh, so I thought maybe I'll just give you a view of the ride home. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna go straight home. Uh, I'm actually gonna go past it and see what it uh, looks like uh, going up to uh, Hatcher Pass. So, I hope you all enjoy the ride and uh, we'll see what happens. Okay, there we go. Alright, whoops. There we are. Okay. So anyway, uh, not too much going on today. Uh, when we get down here a ways, I'm going to stop and get my coffee. And uh, let's see if I can. There you go. Yeah. Matter of fact, I mean. I had a cup of coffee this morning, that was it, so I need another one so I can get me a large and uh, see how uh, dog coffee here. Ugh. Okay. Hey, how you doing? Good. Hey, I like that, uh, that color. Yeah. Yeah, it looks nice on you. Thank you. You're welcome. There you go. What are you doing? Take it. Jeez. Oh, let me put 
put it down to three. Three. There we go. Okay. Well, I can't get this around. Uh, all right. So, uh, you might be able to see the wind. Yeah, the wind's blowing big time. That makes it colder. Oh, well, they look nice though. Right? Yeah. Right. Hey. Have a good day. Hey, you too. This girl that uh, works here, she's really nice. And very, very friendly. And uh, very attractive, but too young. But it's still nice. They, uh, it's funny because they all know uh, what I drink. So when I pull up, I don't have to ask them. They know exactly what uh, I'm going to order. So, there we go. I hope you, I know you've been up this way before, but you know, sometimes things change and, uh, But uh, we're going to go past. Get out of there. What are you doing? Eat your butt cooking. What, you, what are you doing? Hold on, everybody. I don't know. Aurora, what she's doing. Oh, okay. You dropped your cookie. There you go. All right. <sighs> yeah. The uh, girl at the coffee shop, she gave Aurora a cookie. And Aurora dropped it down on the floor. That's what she was trying to get down to get it. But problem is, is that I got the floor loaded with uh, tools. <laughs> I gotta clean this truck out. So here we go. Uh, there we go. Okay. And uh, so I kind of forgot where it was, but Oh yeah, I, you know, I, uh, I had a really good uh, session with my therapist on Tuesday, and uh, we, uh, we were having a good talk, and uh, he told me that uh, if I wanted to, uh, he feels that I don't need to come every two weeks. every three weeks now which I agree I, every three weeks would be fine I'm just kind of getting tired of appointments and all that and uh, plus he told me that uh, he could see uh, a big change in me since I started this uh, channel I told him that it was because of the people out there that subscribe to my channel and who helped me get to where I am today. And it's true. You all did. I mean, you know, you, you guys out there, kind of the best thing that's happened to me in a long time. So, I thank you all for that. bigger. Nope. Made it small. There we go. Okay. There. Okay. Yeah. You can see some of the mountains up there at Hatcher Pass.
better coffee than I do. I don't know how, how they do it, but they make it taste just right. Me, uh, I do my coffee the same way all the time, but it doesn't taste the same all the way. Maybe it's, I need to change the coffee I buy. So, anyway, uh, I hope everybody's having a good day today. Uh, I am. Of course, I always say, uh, any day I wake up breathing, I'm, I'm ahead of the game. It's a great day. But, there we go. Well, there's a mountain up there. So, uh, I've been, uh,
bumpy, but you know, it goes with the uh, the circumstances. The, the road is starting to heave. their channel out I'll tell you what you gotta you gotta look for the uh, short they did on uh, Molly the turkey attacking Daryl <laughs> that I'm telling you that is hilarious and I am surprised that it did not go viral I mean <laughs> she really put a thumping on Daryl. So, yeah, go and uh, look the, go to their channel uh, and look up, uh, I, I think it was pronounced Molly, the, uh, that was the uh, headline, Molly Attacks or something like that. You really gotta, you gotta watch it. I mean, it is just, it, it just makes you laugh so hard. It's crazy. Um, what else? Uh, I have 
not starting and I think I might have to pull a spark plug and clean it. Maybe put a little gas down the plug hole. Okay, here's where I turn to go to my place, so we're going past it. clear this road pretty good. Bunch of trees down though. Got a tree over here that's down. There's one over here that's leaning, ready to come down. A few trees over here on the side to the right. You see are down. It's the snow. It's been the snow's been uh, pushing the trees down. Surprise, nobody is out uh, cutting those trees up, taking them home for firewood. North Star Bible Camp. seen uh, ad from Mountain Mariner Alaska uh, him making a trip to town with his snow machine to pick up uh, his new sled and I've seen those sleds and, uh, I, I don't I, I don't have say about them because I never really saw one uh, being used I don't know how they are I, I the one there is a part of it that I do like and uh, where it keeps the snow from uh, going inside the sled so yeah go over there and check uh, Mount Mariner out and uh, see what he's up to. See a lot of snow machines have been out here. The mountains. The mountains look nice, don't they? off and it's still warm. Yeah. Boy, I wish I could have found property more along this way, closer to, uh, the, to the pass. Okay. 
yeah see that's nice go down and see how the creek is doing see uh, if there's some good spots to uh, go and get water from it plus find a good spot down here for camping this will be my first camping area Part of Willow Creek. Uh, usually, this part of Willow Creek uh, is flowing, but you see snow machine tracks there. Huh, interesting. Another thing is like over here, that's where people park to go snow machining and nobody's there. Oh, I'm surprised. is frozen still wow I've never seen it like this always it's always been open
stop here and take my jacket off. I'm sweating in here. I got the heat turned off. Oh man. Okay. Let me get out of here. Taking my jacket off of her. in my t-shirt now I mean I was really starting to sweat it's crazy got my coffee lead dog coffee isn't that cute <laughs> yeah it's pretty cute good coffee So, uh, Oops. Oh, sorry, folks. I dropped my phone. <laughs> sorry about that. There we go. Let me get that back up. Okay. Uh, There's Aurora. Aurora. Who's that? Who's out there? Who's Aurora. What are you looking for? What are you looking for? What do you see? She's looking for something. I don't know what, but anyway. Uh, there we go. Okay, let me get you back on here. There we go. I'm back. Um... Say hello. Come on. Say hello. Oh. All right. Good girl. Say hello again. Say hi. Oh. <laughs> All right. All right. Let's uh. Let's continue on this trip. Uh, excuse me. Okie doke. See how far we can go. Ooh. I better put this in four wheel drive. Sliding all over. Uh, up here, there's a lot of uh, areas where uh, you can uh, camp right off the road here. And that's probably what I will do. Okie dokie. Right here. It says travel beyond this point not recommended if you must use this road. Expect extreme cold, heavy snow, carry cold weather survival gear, tell someone where you are going. All right, so I told all of you that I'm here at the gate to Hatcher Pass. 
so if anything happens you can call the Alaska State Troopers and tell them who I am and where I'm at. Okay, so If I've ever done this trip up here in the winter time with everyone I, I may have but I don't remember uh, looks like somebody was riding a snow machine over this way now here's this area here, uh, people will stop and camp right in there. And uh, This should be a Sunday drive, but I couldn't wait until Sunday, so I decided to make it a Thursday drive. And there. Snow on the mountains looks so beautiful. Ah, I love it. Absolutely beautiful. see the top of these mountains I keep thinking about Ed from uh, Mountain Mariner 
homestead for Alaska about his place man it would be so nice to live up there trails a lot of moose trail tracks and I've seen some either they're either uh, uh, wolf tracks or coyote tracks or both camera back and forth because the road weaves around so much. that people will stop and camp right here um, all along in here uh, you'll see areas that are cleared out up here and they'll bring their six-wheelers with them or if they have a pickup truck with them uh, which most of them do they'll have uh, plows on them and they'll plow out a spot and sleigh. Man, that would be so cool. I would really enjoy something like that. That mountain, man. Mountains are beautiful. Nothing like a, a good cup of coffee and a ride like this. A good cup of coffee is essential. Man, it's wild. It's so beautiful.
to some this this is probably a long boring road ride but you know what to me uh, I like it because it makes me think about things and I, I it gives me ideas when I see different uh, see the mountains uh, I look at them and I think about stuff that that I could do to make my life uh, better and uh, it actually helps me want to start uh, working tell the truth work around the the cabin pretty. That is pretty. Beautiful. This would be a good camping spot right here. Yeah, this would be an excellent spot to camp. I'm scouring the mountain sides to see if anything is moving stop here for a minute to see if anything is moving up on the mountainside I see moose tracks going up the mountain Maybe I could show you Maybe I could show you the moose tracks. Oh, let me see here. Let's see if I can get that in enough to see them right there. That's moose tracks going up the mountain right there. Yeah. Might be able to see them. I, I don't know if you can or not, but that's those are moose tracks. Okay, let me see. Let me see here. I'll get you back on here on my holder. Okay, there we go.
know if actually you know I, I think if you found the first part of this boring you can always skip ahead to where I just passed my place and it will be less boring here this place is for sale this area right here uh, there's a for sale sign right there where is it yeah right there okay I uh, I looked at that to buy it but then I found out that actually the property that's for sale over here there's like a little road that goes down and then the property is right by the creek and um, unmaintained so you had to have some heavy equipment own heavy equipment to keep the road open plus uh, when uh, the spring and the summer come around all the snow melts and down below it floods so it was not a good deal interesting. I've never seen them plow up here before. so bright it's hard to see. good area to camp right in here
rough areas. tracks going up the mountain or coming down it's hard to tell turn around I mean get out and give you a 360 view 